Yo, 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 yo. What's up, what's up, what's up? Na, 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 na. Doing another casty cast, and this time I am doing a game, or actually I'm doing the finals that were played between Brain and Jose. Look at he's already talking smack. For SCW6. So this was finals. I think, um... Uh, I don't know what it was best of, but never seen any of these games. And look at how aggressive Jose is. Just hates brain. Knows, knows brain's just... There we go. <laughs> yeah, so... We will see. Looks like a Nexus is going to come. Maybe a double gateway. We'll see. Yeah, Nexus is going to come. And this was when Brain was at his peak in SCW. He had played in SCW 1, I think. He played in SCW... Um, SCW... Five, and then he put in SCW six. So his record this season was seventy six and one. He only lost one game, and the other seasons, I think one of them he went one hundred and two and fifteen. Another season he went. Um, ooh, maybe like seventy and ten or something like that, but. This was his best season by far. Absolutely crushed it. So we got a TVP. Jose, we all know Jose. I'm guessing that Jose's gotten better since then. Obviously, his brain's gotten better. And going to go with a choke. Kind of has, has his build order down. So this is kind of the Korean style build. Here's your three racks for brain. And uh, then I'm going to do the SCW 17 tournament in a different cast. It might be a few casts, but it was Scan versus JH. And um, here's your SCV. Going to scout that out. And we'll see if he just goes for a quick push. I don't know how Brain used to play. It looks like he's going for extra command center. And going to bring these guys on home. And that's what he does. He splits these guys up. Make sure no probes are going to come through. And yeah, I just love watching Brain do just the little things. He's got the academy on the way. Going to build maybe an engineering bay. Or he's going to build another command center. He's got a decent amount of gas. There's your second command center. He stopped all marine production. A couple more cannons coming from Jose. Does not want to get busted through the front. And we'll see if he puts up a robo. He's got the gas for it. And there is your engineering bay for brain. And there's your robo on the side. So going to be a little cheesy. This is what you got to prepare for when you're playing Western players like this. There's your three medics on the way. There's your Citadel of a Dune. We'll see if he gets a comp set right away. Yeah, he is going to get that comp set. He really wants to know what he's up against. I'm interested to see how he handles this drop that's going to come from over there. Getting a turret and a bunker right here. He's only made six Marines. Pumping out the Marines right now. Here comes a probe. Going to get a little scout off. Going to try to sneak in. Gonna see another bunker. And not going to be able to get in. And we'll see if a scan comes down really soon. Yep. As I say it. So there's your Citadel. He's going to see. Looks like he's upgrading range. And going to scout the sides. And he might actually spot this out. 
And he knows... There it is. He knows these little things. He just start laughing at them. And we'll see if... Jose calls him a hacker or something. But this is eventually going to go down. There's your shuttle that's going to spawn. Sending some Dragoons on over. Got the Marines on the side. Getting that upgrade up here. Going to start walling this off. And Reaver on the way. Two Dragoons. Four. It's going to be five Marines. So... Gonna stim these guys up, try to take out this pylon as quickly as he can, which he will. So, smart little move there by Brain. And Brain's gonna start talking smack. This was. Brain doesn't talk smack anymore. This was. And I mean, he obviously. You're gonna talk smack to Jose. Not even spending his money that good. So. But Jose. Beat everyone to get into the finals. So this was the finals. Scan coming down. Gonna see Jose's base. And only has three barracks, one factory. Getting that second upgrade. Got a couple turrets on the side. Gonna build a starport right here in a tough spot. So it'll be easy to drop him. We'll see what Jose goes for. He's got so much gas. Making some zealots. Going to start filling out his base, maybe. Getting that one upgrade. Two more forges. Some more cannons over here. Kind of playing this defensive. And Brain is kind of sitting back. Look at him just spend his money. Try to keep it under 300. Just insane. So this upgrade's finished. Always pulling the SCVs. He's got a couple bunkers back here. Getting some turrets. Bunker right there. Getting a lot of turrets on this side. Getting that upgrade. Getting a science facility. Just pumping out of one factory. Gonna lift this up. Scan coming down. Gonna see the upgrades getting made. And speed on the way for Jose. Here is another barracks. And usually, Brain was very symmetrical with his base, so I'm surprised this barracks is a little out of place. He might move it over. For some reason, he likes to be very symmetrical with his base. So he's got. Three tanks, four tank right there, another one on the way. Getting another factory, two factories, three factories, four factories. Pulling these guys in the back. Gonna see a reaver drop right here. A couple more depots on the way. 117 supply to 131. And this drop. Let's see if he's got speed on the way, but no way that drop's gonna make it. And starting to fill out his base. Gonna build a turret right there, turret right there. He's got a lot of turrets on the side right here. Yeah, he's gonna move that barracks over. So he's gonna have six factories right here and start making his base huge. Another factory right there. Another scan coming down. I'm gonna scan the middle. I see cannons getting made in the middle. And more turrets. I mean, Brain's just like a computer. Just playing against a computer. And obviously he was trying his hardest this game. Does not want to lose any of these games. I think he wanted to prove that he's the, the best of all time. This was when he was trying to prove that he was the best of all time. And he currently is the best. So, another scan coming down. Keep scanning this middle right here. Looking for drops. I also think he might be wondering if Jose's still pumping out probes. And if he knows he's still pumping out probes, then he knows he's not maxed out. Gonna siege up some tanks back here. 
Gateway right there. A couple more turrets. And gonna start making some Goliaths. Frontal attack gonna be coming soon. There's that one upgrade. One upgrade on attack for Brain. He's got one one upgrades for his uh, bio. Building an expo right here. And sending these guys on out. Gonna take this out. Here's your drop. Stargate on the way. And I'm gonna use this reaver. We'll see some micro. I'll try to snipe out that reaver, but decent micro from Jose right there. And already starting to push out with his tanks. He's got some glides. He's got a full base. Here's your drop. And this is going to get sniped out so fast. And Bray going to just... <laughs> I love it. Oh. And looks like Jose is going to wait for Brain to kind of move out a little bit too far. And then try to counter. 1-1 one, one upgrades for Brain. He's got a pretty big base. Here's your expo of Stargates for Jose. And scan coming down. He's going to see this. He knows he's going to be up against carriers probably. Not yet though. And he'll probably start scanning all the other bases. Let's see if Jose goes for the attack pretty soon. He's getting his units in position. Brain going to start sending out. Some marines on the side get that vision here comes your big attack and let's just see how he's got this place he's got tanks back here he's got tanks over here a couple storms coming down a lot of storms coming down and jose is gonna take out that army but there's a decent amount of tanks he's gonna repair this tank right here storm coming down that tank's gonna go down and sieging these up. He's got some Goliaths coming. A couple more command centers on the side. Here's a couple more Templars. Another couple storms gonna come down, but La Jose is at 142 supply. And Brain has a full base right now. Let's see if he gets a science vessel. He's got a couple ghosts for the carriers, and the carriers are on the way. So we'll see if he scans this out. He's sending these guys over here. He's got a guy over here. Here comes another attack from Jose. 1-1-2 one, one, upgrades. Brain's got 1-2 upgrades. And gonna start moving on out and go for the attack. Taking out this bunker. Taking out both of those bunkers. Here's your attack. And I'm not sure if he scanned this. But he's searching for expos. Let's see if he spots this out. He is going to see this. Going to scan it as well. This carrier should be spawning soon. And going for the attack and get rid of some of the probes. A decent amount of the probes. And here are your five carriers. And he's doing what Gensei used to do. Out. Leave. Going to attack this. He's got the ghosts over here. Those carriers are complete, so he might just pull those guys back. I mean, he just made this TVP. He's making it look easy. Gonna siege this guy up.
And Brain actually thinks he ca uh, canceled those carriers. But he actually still has them. Seven carriers right here. Here's your Templars. The Storm. Scan coming down. He's going to see the carriers right there. So he's going to pull his ghosts. And maybe we'll see some lockdown. Oh, there's one lockdown. Two lockdowns. We saw him do that against Gold SCV. Which is absolutely sick. And once these guys get in here, it's going to be over. Cloaking them up like a boss. Let's see what this looks like for Jose. Whoops. Not going to even see these guys. Going to cloak them and just... I mean, just so sick. Can't even see him. Brain making this look easy peasy F baby. Jose's probably not going to give up. Getting more cannons. Two, three upgrades for Brain. Building some turrets in here. I mean, just complete domination. There's a couple carriers back here. Those are going to get locked down. Here's your vessel. Scan's coming down. He's probably scanning the whole map. Scanning all of this. And, yeah, there's just no way Jose is going to be... I didn't even mean to say it like that. There's just no way that Jose is going to be able to... He can't beat this. Press net. It's gonna go lock down this guy right here. Lock down that one. This guy's coming for the other one, but I think he's gonna die. He's gonna get it. Gets it. Yeah, this one's over, rover. And that's what you get for talking smack. Man center right there. Let's see what goes. They do 10 3. They got. They do 13 damage. And there's the no GG, of course, from Jose. So. That was game one. Let's go into the second one. So it's going to be a ZVP. And Brain gonna be right next to him. So we'll see. We'll see if Jose goes for the same strategy or goes for a middle build. Nope, he's not gonna go for a middle build. Brain gonna go for a choke. Yeah, we'll see how Brain plays this. Choke, then pool. There's your Nexus for Jose. There's your scout. And we'll see how early Brain gets his gas. So he scouts up, and he brings this guy on over. Jose going to go with the same strategy for the most part. Here's your gas getting it at about 1, one minute and 53 seconds. So his ZVT must be insane. Here comes your cannon, bringing the drone up. Going to build the, the creep colony into the sunken. Here's your gateway. We'll probably see double gas from Jose. Basically, be the same. Two cannons right there. Just one pair of Zerglings on the way. Trying to figure out where he wants to put this. He's going to put it right there. So he can kind of wall it off if he wants to. 
or you can start building on out. So here's your Zerglings. These cannons, are they going to finish in time? I think the one did. Oh, is he going to get it? Not going to. He's going to save that Zergling right there. And maybe he'll go with Zergling speed. He can get that lair right now. He's got the 100 gas. Not completely sure what he's going to go for. Got a couple more Zerglings right here. Pulling this guy up. There's your second creep colony. And I'm not sure if this is regular StarCraft or Brood War. I have a feeling it's regular. I'm trying to think. Last game, I didn't see any Valkyries or anything like that. Here's your Overlord, gonna get some information. Gonna have four seconds. He's got the Zerglings and already talking smack. I love it. What's he upgrading? He's got the 100 gas. Don't know why Brain's saving the 100 gas. There must be a reason. He's gonna start getting some more gas now. Maybe that was just his build order. Here's a couple of zealots. Here's your overlord. Let's see what Jose's up to. Dragoon gonna spawn in the wrong spot. So this guy's trapped. Another hatchery. Here's your hydro den. Here's your chamber. You can see that Dragoon stuck in there. Here's a Robo, gonna start going for the push. And getting Hydro Speed. So we'll see if he goes for maybe just Hydros. I don't see a Citadel or anything. Getting that upgrade. And he's got a, just a total of four Sunkins. This is what it feels like to play a computer. There's another hatchery coming down. A computer that has AI. It just, it is AI. Knows what to do. Getting some more information over here. He's got this overlord over here. Sending this guy on out, maybe looking for an expo. There's a couple hydras right here. Four. Five, six. We'll see if he gets range right after. Yeah. I mean, just look at how quickly he got range. As soon as it was done, he just knows. So he's just going to start pumping out the hydras right now. Another two hatcheries coming down. Let's see if a reaver is going to be on the way. Here's another robotics. Trying to get this guy, but doesn't have range. Needs to get range. A lot of cannons coming at home. And... Looks like Brain's going to go for the attack. He's got a decent amount of Hydras right here. Going to start on moving on out. Going to kill that Sunken. It's in the way. And this is going to be bad for these Zealots. They're going to have to go around. And he's going to be able to use this to his advantage here. I think this is going to be... So this is not the best placement for... I mean, these Zealots have to single file go in here and Brain sees that and uses that to his advantage. And that upgrade should be getting close to being done. Gonna take out one cannon right there. There's your second one. Gonna micro out. Snipe it out some more zealots. He's gonna take out these two cannons really quick and then micro them back. And just gonna keep pumping out the hydras. Ton of cannons right there. He takes that out, so these are gonna be. Ooh. Yeah, he really calling the game. Getting his lair right now. I mean, he's got the one upgrade. Here's your speed. Gonna take out this cannon right there. 
I just don't get how he was able to get so many hatcheries like that. Is he getting a second upgrade? Not yet. And a bunch of cannons in right can cannons in here. Gonna micro these guys back. He's got did he does he have overlord speed? No. But he does bring an overlord in here. Maybe this is not sure why you would bring an overlord in here if this wasn't brood war. Purpose being for the DTs. He's bringing another overlord in here. Gonna micro these guys. And he's gonna probably try to take out all of these cannons if he can. So more hydras coming in. And maybe he's gonna try to go back door. Gonna take out the support bay. Some more cannons coming down. More hydras just coming in. Just pumping like an absolute beast. Playing at 360 APM as a Zerg player. Getting a second upgrade. Getting a little bit closer right here. I mean, he just made that look so easy. So easy. So we're going to win a TVP, a ZVP. Let's see what the next game is. Another TVP. So he's getting all the bad matchups. So brain going to be bottom middle. Yeah. Starcraft World. I wish Brain would come back. Come back and play Buell on SCW map. Gonna go for a mid build. <laughs> Hilarious. He kind of talks like Gensei. When Gensei played. Here's your double barracks. See if he goes into a third barracks or if he gets gas. See if he plays any different. Probably not. The scout right now though. And see if he scouts the middle. But I have a feeling he thinks he's up against a Zerg just because he's been up against Protoss twice already. Yeah, so he's gonna go with the gas. That's why he's just scouting the chokes. So, this is how you play a TVZ. And gonna scout here. Just scouting the chokes, gonna see he's up against the mid build. And let's see how he plays this. He's got one Marine here. And gonna build the Academy, or is this a depot? There's your Academy. Let's see if he gets a bunker. This is going to be interesting to see. We'll see some nice micro from Brain. Two Marines here. Comes your first Zelly and a Probe. Going to see this. There's a Pylon coming down. We pulled that guy a little bit late. Here's your Marines. He's probably going to pull this guy back. I mean, just... Let me just pause it. One of the biggest things to be able to do with Marine Micro against Zoss is to time your opponent. Uh, to time your opponent when they're going to retreat. So, say you're moving back, and you're trying to time when they think, okay, that's too many units. I'm going to pull my units back. So, if you could time it perfectly, he just did it right there. You'll get, you just get free shots off. So. I'll see, we'll see if it happens again. So this is too many too many units right here, so he can't do it. He's got a bunker right here. Going to put this guy on the side. 
We go back to his bunker. That academy should be almost done. Done right now. Gonna go into the double medic. And no cannon coming just yet. There's your three gateways. So we got five zealots right here. Wanna keep that one bad zealot in the back. And this, there's your factory. And a fire bat on the way, repairing some of his units. And he's probably going to start moving on out. Here's your cannons right here. Getting another refinery. And you're going to start moving on up. Let's see if he's got stim. Doesn't have stim yet. So we're going to have to retreat these guys. Loses a marine right there. And these cannons are going to finish, so... Stim is done. Here's a, a bunker. Let's see if he get, gets range. And he's going to take out this right here. Surprised he isn't stimmed up. There we go. And going to micro these guys back. Take out that cannon right there. Then micro him back. Playing at 370 APM. Just insane. He's got a starport on the way as well. So he might go for a quick tank drop. And let's see if he's not getting range yet. So I'm going to get another barracks right here. More cannons coming down from Jose. He's got gas. He's got a cyber on the way. Here's an engineering bay. Just in case he's going to be up against DT. He's going to try to take out this pylon. There's your tank and siege on the way. Might go for a fire bat drop. I can see him doing that. Maybe he'll build one more bunker just to be safe. And I think he's going to stim and get some free shots off on these guys right here. He sees that. Here's a pylon over here. Doesn't see that right now. Tank almost done. Turret getting made just in case he's up against DTs. Getting that upgrade. More marines on the way. Still no range. I mean, he's just his reaction time is just so fast. I'm gonna start taking this out, stimming these guys up, getting that drop ship, getting that second tank, and I'm gonna stim these guys, put them back in the bunker, and gonna make Jose have to retreat. And here's your tank gonna start moving on out. Citadel of a dune. Dropship almost done. Takes out the one cannon. Gonna start moving on out. Wants to be a little bit careful though. Gets it in a position where I think he'll be able to hit both of these. And here's your drop tank and four fire bats. There's a turret right here. I'm gonna build. Maybe he'll build a. There's a zealot coming on in. Another dropship. See if he starts getting his choke after this. There's a Templar archives. And here's your drop. No cannons at home. And this upgrade might be close to being done. Here's your drop tank. Gonna see dropping the fire bats and <laughs> just absolutely murked Jose. I mean, just a middle build against him. Can't do anything. Gonna go save his dropship. Gonna try to get the main right here, which I think he's gonna be close. Running these guys in, going for the main. They're hunting. They got one job, get the main. Stimming them in. 117, not gonna get it. He's got the drop ship with the double tank. <laughs> and now he's just gonna play around, I think.
It's got the upgrade. I'm gonna start making command centers all over the place. Getting nukes ready. Probably just gonna shoot at his own guys right here. Yeah, see, so shooting at his own collateral damage. Watch this. Yeah. Still gonna be 3 0 right now. Oh, we got a PVT. Brain's gonna be on the Protoss. See what Brain does. Jose's pissed. And he's going to go for a mid build of his own. One thing is, he can go for a mid build, but then if it doesn't really work out, he goes for a triple Nexus. He did it against Mong. And uh, he was able to make it. Go into a, long, a late game. Here's your two gateways. Pulling out the third probe. And he gets the gateways before he starts making that other probe. So here's your scout. And we'll see if Brain did the split of the Zelots back then like he does now. He'll, he'll bring one Zelot over here or two Zelots up there. Going to be annoying with the probe. I wonder what got Brain into fastest. I mean, he was a low money beast. He's just so good at it. Takes out one SCV, nicely done. And two zealots on the way, three zealots on the way. I'm gonna start building a pylon right here. See if he gets a forge, you put a pylon right here. There's your forge. There's a marine coming on out. Fourth barracks on the way. No gas. And we're gonna have two zealots, one zealot and a probe. That's pretty weak though. Gonna micro this back. Cannon gonna come down. Should be almost done, it is done. Got three zealots in here. And six marines right here. Eight marines now. I'm gonna take out an SCV. And that's just what he does. Three zealots. And he just gets so much done with his zealots. Moves the bad one in the back. This cannon's gonna finish up. Three zealots right here, another cannon on the way. I put one more. These guys are gonna accidentally die. Let's see if he gets gas. Here is another cannon. He puts the cannon out there and tries to bait the marines. I mean, just look at his spending, it's just insane. Gonna micro back. Another cannon coming down. Pylon coming down. Trying to wait for these guys to move out, but this cannon's gonna finish. And Gangster Jose just gonna leave. I mean, nothing he could do. Too easy. 
too easy. And it looks like we got another short PBT. Probably gonna be the exact same thing. So he pulls out the probe on seven. So he pulls it out on eight. Gonna go for the mid build. I guess he he won six hundred dollars. Here's your other probe. Gonna scout. Puts that pylon right here. And <laughs> comes another probe in here to be annoying here's the pylon right there I think we know what's gonna happen here micro and these guys gonna get this marine oh Yam yam. Don't know what that means, but it's pretty funny. And now he's just having fun. He's got probably a forge on the way. Probably gonna build it right here. Cannon up here, I'm guessing. There's your first cannon. There's a couple of fire bats. I think you should have went with medics first. This must be Brewer because there were medics last game. I think. Yeah. So fire bats are gonna get owned right there. Cannon gonna be finishing up over here. So easy for brain. Gonna go five and zero. Oh. So I think he ended up going for that season eighty-one and one. That season. So SCW six finals. Brain won six hundred bucks. Good games right there. Brain just showing you why he's just an absolute monster. So give it a like, give it a subscribe, and I'll talk to you guys later. Peace.